it is unimaginable that uh, Buddy can reduce himself to such a rumor monger uh, whereby he can decide to be making wild allegations because when you look at all this, they are carefully designed to paint the governor in bad light. Buddy went to parliament and lied that he found a body of a dead person on the staircase, somebody who had been following up a, um, a, a, a pending bill. Let Buddy take you, uh, provide the OB number of, uh, because that's a police case automatically. Let Buddy provide uh, the OB number of where that case was re reported, to which mortuary that person was taken, and what is the name of that person, and perhaps where they were buried, if indeed they were buried. So you realize it is unfortunate, especially at a time like this, when there are ongoing discussions between the county government of Nairobi and the national government being under, undertaken in the office of the attorney general to regularize the concerns that Justice Ellen Wasilo raised in a ruling that declared NMS as an illegal and unconstitutional outfit. Buddy should be dedicating his energies towards that process. Since those meetings started at the attorney general's office uh, over two weeks ago, the Nairobi County government has been there every day whenever a meeting is called. So the governor wishes uh, to, to, to appeal to Buddy to stop the theatrics if he's unable to undertake the job that he was given by the president. The honorable and the decent thing would be for him to resign and go back to the military. Nairobi is still functional. Nairobi is fully operational. Nairobi had not failed by the time the governor uh, agreed to partner with the national government. And the Nairobi county still remains established under Article 176 of the Constitution.